my name is Pimpisa. Fugo Takefsa. To be Malsa Haibani. Shinora Desa Naika. It shows that no matter how much work and how much time you put into something, like at, at the end of the day, it will show. It shows that hard work pays off and commitment and it means that I can pay for my tuition at Victoria University and it can really help me. And this scholarship means that my hard work and all the learning I've done and all the support and help that I've gotten from teachers and friends and the staff at Upper Education has worked and it has helped me a lot. Teacher and uh, my peers uh, helped me, help me a lot and because whenever I struggle with studying and uh, I ask them to ask for the advice and they give me uh, some good advice. Up education, rather than just a school or a course, up education is kind of like a family. So all the teachers are supportive and all the students are very friendly. So when you come here, it's a community. Definitely time management. If you don't manage your time and you don't prioritize what assignments, what projects you're going to do first, it's not going to help cramming all the information last minute. I would say work hard, do your studies, finish your assignments as early as you can, but don't rush. Take your time, do your research, read, write, and definitely improve your English and use all the resources that you have that you can get. In my first term, it was me getting used to the school and mm. used to the system, so it was quite difficult for me to blend in. But then by the second term, I got really comfortable and I felt more confident and I felt more assured. Really like, you know, writing it first, but all of the students, they're so amazing, so it was, it was hard. <laughs> I think the biggest challenge was the fact that this term was online, so it did uh, take quite a while for me to get used to that and learn a lot, but I was able to overcome it at the end.